morning had this great idea for how to make stronger, stronger, thinner, lighter glass. What we're looking at is a sandwich where you've got two layers of glass. So this is your conventional glass. You've got two layers of soda lime. Go ahead, why don't you hold that for a minute. This is our Gorilla Glass that we're using on the GT and we're looking on, on future models. Go ahead and feel the difference. It's about 30 pound, 30% uh, lighter. On the GT, that's an 11 pound save on the windshield. On a conventional vehicle, if you look at the total glass in the windshield, the doors, the backlight, the moonroof, it's about a 30 pound save. So by reducing that weight on the vehicle, and particularly at the top of the vehicle, we're able to lower the center of gravity. We lower the center of gravity, we get better handling, better braking, better performance, and better fuel economy, right? That, but the trick to making this all work is that thin layer on the backside, that thin layer of Gorilla Glass has to be strong, has to be stronger than the soda line. And fortunately, the new material that Corning has provided us with the Gorilla Glass is actually two to three times stronger than conventional soda line glass. It happens very fast. Yeah, and manageable. Basically, he's going to say, and then you'll see the results of you. So it's going to be pretty quick. upstairs and show you the very first piece of production, Gorilla Glass, on our very first production for